Well, hello. This is the, the final boss. Point was a real and this is Exoplanet. I've never been that far from the core worlds. But the travel was quite easy. Beth was about to make her entry into the atmosphere when my luck went south. I had to uh, cut off some of the intro because there was uh, a sorry, little bit of Mr. Sharp. questionable content. We are taking your ship. That would not be approved by YouTube. Land at the drop off. <laughs> and we'll take care of the captain. Though I'm a little concerned there's going to be more shenanigans to come, so we'll see. Uh, that's, is that too loud? Seems loud. But essentially, I took a job I should not have taken. Trash bag. Hell no. Freeze! Take that, you bastard! What have you done, you moron? So we were shipping some sketchy equipment somewhere. I believe it's time to part ways. Wait. Farewell. Mr. Sharp. <laughs> well, was a few kilometers above the land, and I was falling. Yep, that's a problem. The end. That'll do it. Falling from a few kilometers might get you. So essentially. I was in some sketchy club, which was where the questionable content that I could not stream on YouTube or put on YouTube was um, as this character. And somebody offered me a job that was in a corporate area, which I think is kind of like, you know, the dystopian business government thing. RMB to block with melee weapon. Shift RMB. <clears throat> okay. Right okay anyways so uh i took this job they brought some weird sketchy equipment onto my ship and apparently um it was a little suspect they double crossed me i did not see it coming and here i am but yeah overall i think the uh what, what do i think about the storytelling so far i think the art style is you know thoughtful i i think uh it's it's giving me a good sense of the character and the story i think it feels like a very typical space scummy setup which is i took one last job and it all went south so i like you know i, I do wonder hey is there something more unique to this story that can uh oh <laughs> this is the problem I mean, got to put the hat on, right? All right. Re reboot sequence complete, Mr. Sharp. What F? What are you? RMB continue. All right. I'm Anna, your artificial neural network advisor. Don't worry. I will take care of you. I feel like uh, this is uh, the the good place. Like, what's the what's the like the um... Janet Janet from the Good Place? Oh my gosh! Request is denied. You're a weird AI. Some of our responses may seem strange to you. Please listen to me. My ship, the most important part of my life, is stolen by this guy named Smiley. I want to get my home back, and if you want to do it alone, that's why I should down in the first place. He's he turn off. Request is denied. I order you to turn off. Turn off now. You have a lot to do. Stay calm. I am your ally. <laughs> I 
worth the money I spent. Uh, but I didn't spend any money, actually. Um, worth the money they spent on you, building you. Start tutorial. Sure. Show me you're worth the money I spent. Learning program Survival for Dummies is launched. Woo! I mean, the movement feels pretty good. I like the third person. Oh, I like the right click to focus. Oh, wow. Kapow. Kabing. I like that I have a little dot in the center of my screen to show me where center is. You should arm yourself. All right. Um, I want, trust me, that is front of mind for me. Self-defense. Unidentified plant branch. Oh, look at these bugaboos. Use another mode of your scanner to scan. I can analyze the object and give you information. Journal update. Ah, uh, how do I scan? So I have stealth. Perspective shift. Okay, Q. Ah! <laughs> okay, maybe I shouldn't have fought those. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have fought those. Granted. Okay. Uh, e is load. I kind of just want to, like, get, uh, shoot something. Wait for the program to respond. Please come back. Wait for the program to respond. Oh, no. Oh, no. Close the program. All right. Well, it crashed on load. But it's a cool project so far. I really hope it doesn't make me replay the uh, intro story because that was where some nudity was. And so then I'll have to start this video over again because I don't feel like editing. I'm just going to start spamming escape. Man, there's a lot of loading time. Maybe my computer just has too much in... Uh... We'll see. We'll see. Cache those textures. I mean, this has survival game vibes where it seems to be a little punishing if I don't make good decisions, you know, and I'm not great at decision making. So that's going to be an issue for my longevity and survival. Uh, cache those textures. Oh, okay. Resume. Okay, we're back. We're back. Hell, you know what? I probably should turn all the graphics down from like psych psychotic because you distance. Let's shrink that down a little bit. Um, shadows being field of view. I don't think I want triple buffering, right? What does that do? Oh, maybe. Enables the... Uh... Alright. We'll go with this. Let's cut out some of the field of view. You must leave this place. Alright. All right, bone. Bone beef. During combat, double tap. Sad. All right, so I have to do that during combat. I mean, it kind of seems to want me to fight these things. Use another mode of your scanner. Press I or tab for inventory. Credit. You must scan a bug. I did scan a bug. Did I not? Alright, so what's better? This has blunt damage of something. 
This does nothing. Good to know. Bone it is. <laughs> Don't want this. Alright. Is that right? Yeah, that does... Yeah, scan is Q. So that's kind of crummy. Seems like a downgrade. I don't know. Slug bug. Alright, so... I, okay, so worker bug. Okay, worker class. Okay, we got some bugs scanned. What do we do now? Uh, leave this place. Okay, the bugs got me last time, so that's not where I want to go. So I want to save, because last time it was cruel to me. And kick my booty. Uh, I'm going to go into this nice area. Is this friend? Dick zero. All right. Oh, what's up? It's my AI friend. Do not dare come near this thing. Talk to me first. Okay. The universe is this. There's nothing in my database that matches this anomaly. Don't touch this anomaly. Tech one. Tech one. My tech skills suck. Okay, like there's not enough riddles. Survived by a miracle now this there must be an explanation. Alright, won't bring my ship back, won't get me out of here. Press F to show Hot Wheel. Two, one, okay. No, I don't think I wanna. Targeting each attempt. All right, we're getting some plants. I mean. Plants and shrooms, baby. That's what we're living on. I will leave the anomaly alone then. Oh, here are the bugs. Alright, I'm going to save again because the bugs kicked the crap out of me last time. And I'm going to save scum because I don't want to do this over again. <laughs> oh, shnikes. Hi, dude. I would love to be able to equip my bone, please. Dude, what the F? Where's my bone? Thank you. Dude, this freaking worker bug's a savage. I blocked. Oh, I dodged. F that. Oh. The combat's a little janky, but I respect it. If it crashes on autosave too, though, I will go ahead and summarize my thoughts. We'll see. It's an interesting project, though. I like the the world building. I think it's a cool idea, a cool project. I think it still is a little early in terms of its... Hey, are we getting there? Or did it crash again? Hey, we're here. Okay, I want to back up because this bug is a freaking beast. I do not want to touch that. Alright, so I actually want to freaking have my bone equipped, please. Is it H to, like, unharness? Dude, how do I get my bone out? Is it F? Oh, where's my where's my bone, man? How? Huh? Dude. How? Okay. 
That seemed to work. I think I'm just gonna run. These bugs kick the crap out of me. Is that even an option? Or is it like, I'm just that bad at games? Oh yeah, there was a crouch. And like sneak attack? Got him. Oh, dodge, 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 move! I pressed A twice! Ugh. So, the comment's a little clunky. I was trying to do the AA dodge. It did not let me. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and call it here. I'm glad I killed one of the monsters. I feel very accomplished. Um, yeah, the combat's a little clunky. I mean, granted, I am bad at video games, so that might be it. But, yeah, I think, obviously, cool concept, interesting world. I like the idea of this, like, kind of secret tech and the secret AI coming in, which is kind of very um, prophetic, I guess, because, you know... We're in a world of kind of these wild AIs doing funny things. Um, but yeah, I think there's a lot of cool ideas here. Whether it... You know, I think one of the things that this game would need to really, really, you know, click with me personally. Like, survival games, not my favorite genre. I did like the combat, but I kind of wanted to feel a little bit more powerful. Um... So, like, I'm, I'm kind of, like, what would it have been like if I was, you know, a diplomat or something? Um, I think there's some cool concepts here, though. And, like, I think with really making the moving around the world and the combat feel amazing, I think that would be my top priority. Because kind of movement feels a little heavy and kind of laggy. And the combat... Um, felt like I was not able to do what I was trying to get the avatar to do. Um, whether that's my own error or whether that's something the developers might might help them change uh, course on certain things, who knows. But yeah, I liked the idea of the story. Um, there were a few localization things that I thought, or translation potentially things, or just odd phrasing that I kind of caught every now and then. But overall, I was interested to kind of see what happened next, but unfortunately, I was prevented by kind of the difficulty, at least for me as a player, as a bad player, uh, being able to go further in the world. But cool project. Thank you so much for sending it over, and I wish you all the very best in your continued development. Tally-ho.